Can I get it? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back in. I am the True Small. Welcome back to the Mad Circus. This is Fullcroft Monastery. Uh, this is a game, a horror game. So we're going to bring, jump right into it. But basically, it looks like it's going to be part one. I saw the developer is actually making a sequel to this game. Uh, so it should be very, very interesting. But basically, you're tasked with recovering some type of artifact. You go to this monastery. And of course, things never work out as they, we, we expect them to. So... Uh, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Let's not waste any more time. If you guys enjoy the video, please leave a like on it. It does help the video immensely. I greatly appreciate you watching. But let's have some fun. Let's get scared. Let's go. Here we go. My name is Anthony. I was approached by a man claiming to work for an organization known only as the SMS Group. He offered me a contract to retrieve an artifact from a abandoned monastery that upon completion would pay $100,000. With my bill stacking hope, my home in shambles, and no hope on the horizon, I took the author and asked little questions. Supposedly, the locals claim that the old monastery is haunted, the home to an ancient evil. I don't believe in ghosts, but I do believe in money, and money would help me get my life back together. So easy that we can just drive right up to the front gate of this place? No security. Got it. Everybody drives this type of car, man. There's like a gremlin or something. <clears throat> Everybody always has that. All right, we got some crows. Okay. Not sure what we're looking for, but let's go in. Locked. Maybe there's another way. Something's back there. Find something to break the lock. Okay. We could do that. Something's glowing up here. Can't run. Not that I'm seeing. So it looks like it's a steady pace here. Oh, right, got a hammer. Masonry hammer. Alright. I'm guessing we're going to break that lock with it. Breaking and entering. Man, that lock sucked. All right. This place is out in the middle of just the mountains, huh? Very nice. Oh, what the hell? Trash looks like it fell over or something. Probably got some rats or something in there. Out in the middle of the woods. Makes sense. Got an axe. Take the axe. So, so somebody else can't use it against us. Of course not. Why would we, right? Why would we indeed? Anything in there? Hello? Anyone? Nope. Oh, the pumpkins. At Halloween time? Oh. Alright, I guess we're in here. Let's see what we got a note here. We had to call off the renovation projects here at the monastery. Too many workers were becoming ill, and we believe it may be caused by some sort of mold around the place due to its age. Hopefully soon we can get a team up to find the source so the project can resume. All right, that's fair. Crowbar? Nope. Maybe we can get that crowbar later. I'm surprised that these pumpkins are not rotted completely. You know what I mean? I literally got food here for quite... Look, they got potatoes and sweet potatoes and everything. Like, somebody's living here. Stuff on the stove. This place hasn't seen power for years. Well, then how are they, uh... Remove the boards. We're gonna need that crowbar. I bet you we go back and get that crowbar. Yeah, but how's all this... All this stuff is good, but there's no power. Somebody's just living off of the, the food. Uh, now the crowbar is glowing. Got it. Weird that we couldn't take it before, but that's not a big deal. Hello? What's this? What is this? Oh no! I have dealt with you before! It's the evil nun. <laughs> Unbelievable. A lot of people are using that, the, those assets. 
the, the evil nun. I mean, it makes sense in this one, the monastery, but there's a lot of, uh, a lot of reuse of that, of that, uh, that model. Hey, look at the size of these sunflowers. That's crazy. Ladder is missing. We need a ladder to go down there. Good Lord, there's some big old sun. Hello? I thought I heard a voice. It's like a creepy old school one. All chained up. Like very, very old school. I wonder what year this takes place in. I mean, it's got to be fairly modern. Need something to burn the roots. Right? Because of, uh, we got flashlights, we got text messages, 100k. Like, you know what I mean? Hello? I'm freaking myself out now. You ever do that? Alright, we gotta be able to go in here. Yep. Alright, looks like a dining hall. Deserted dining hall. Pendulum is missing. I do like that it gives you like a big old hand that shows up so you know whether or not you can click on it or not. Hmm. Ah, I see. We got to this spot over here. Full chest, that door is blocked. This opens up, there we go. Got a whole bunch of doors. Alright. Up, up, uh, just looking for an artifact. Is this the artifact we want? Oh. Picture just fell off. Fine. There's blood. Is that a TV I hear? Sir? Hey, are you the caretaker? Um, I was told to come here. Nice doll heads everywhere. Um. Of course he's gone. Oh, yeah. No, I heard you. I hear Lyle and Clear. Get out. Got it. Got it. Doesn't want me here. I'm not supposed to be here. I was supposed to be. Oh, no. Oh boy, where there's red, there's always something dead. Hello? Hello? Fallen? Okay. Oh, we got bolt cutters. Not like a door open or lock. Cool. All right, we got bolt cutters. Let's go cut the uh, chains outside. Good lord. All right, that startled me. All right, we're good. We're good. It's okay. It was just the. It was the same. The same guy just running. He's just running around. I probably freaked him out. He's nervous because somebody's here. He doesn't know what to do. I get it. You know what I mean? I get it. What we got down here? The chest. This is like a little church, huh? Yeah, nothing creepy about this at all. What? No, I can't see you. Am I supposed to see you? Who the hell was that? All right, this is getting creepy. Uh, okay, four digit code. Five digit code. All right, I don't like that somebody's talking to me. This is, uh, this is awful. We go out the other side here. Nope. Uh, what's down here? Okay. I don't know what it is. I, I just feel like there's no creepier basement. I mean, basements are creepy enough as it is, but a basement in a church? Like, you know it's not going to be good. Oh, I see you. Hey. <laughs> Why are we here? Oh, son of a... Who threw the books? I jumped because I just, I can't believe that you would throw books like that. Good literature, you know? Uh, 
Alright, we got something over here. Oh, we got the thing for the clock. Okay. Hey! Alright, I see you peeking. Peekaboo! <sighs> Something's missing. Okay, so we gotta find something for the statues. Got it. Okay. Nothing jumped out. Good. 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 Okay. We got flames here. We got we got we got something over here. Let's take a look. Mother Eliza says we are to prepare to leave the monastery. She is afraid that the evil here cannot be contained for much longer. We have done our very best, but I feel that this place has too much of a dark past for the likes of us to transform it. I do not know where our covenant will move on to from here, but I pray that newcomers will stay away from this place because by then the evil may be free. Yeah, it's, it's free. And I, it may be your, uh, your person. Oh. Okay. There's a handprint here. Need a lighter. Got it. Okay. Uh, let's try this door. Oh. All right. Well, we do have the clock pendulum, so let's go up. Uh, let's go up to the clock and see what that unlocks. This is creepy. The fact that you can't run right here drives me crazy. Like these old cobblestone things, like just the old, very old school. It looks cool. I mean, for this to be an inch, I stubbed my toe and it scared me. Um, this is like an indie game. Like this is, this is pretty cool looking. I'm enjoying it. Had a couple good jump scares so far. Not a lot of, uh, not crazy difficulty puzzles, but that's fine. Alright, let's put this in here and hope that nothing bad happens. We all know it's going to, though. Hello? Oh, no. Oh, no. Candles are lit. This is, this is going to be bad things. Hello? Oh, we got something in the fireplace. What is it? Oh, it's the thing for the Ouija board. The one thing I don't really want to mess with. Cool. Can I get it? Oh! And yes, I get it when I jump scare. I sound like Hank Hill. I've heard it before. I can't do anything about it. I'm sorry. That's that's my yell. That's my yell. Oh, this is open. What's in here? Oh no, he's back in there. Oh, it's a lighter. Oh god, he left. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. 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 Oh, God. What is this? Lighter fluid. Okay. And a note. It won't let me leave here. I lost track of how many nights it has been. Weeks maybe. All I wanted was a shelter from the storm, but now I am trapped. This place is cursed and it wants me to feed it. I'm almost out of food. Most of what I found here is expired or decayed. I did not believe in a God before, but with something this evil there has to be good. Please, if you're out there, don't let, I can't, don't let this place take me. It's hard to see with the light and everything. All right. Well, we have enough to, I'm guessing that's maybe that's the guy who's running around here. Trap. We have enough to burn the place up top, but we also have this thing for the, the Ouija board we need to go do, which is going to be awful. Anytime you're doing into a head with dolls hanging and the candles are now lit let's see what it says three seven 
four, nine, five. Three, seven, four, nine, five. So it's got to be the code to that chest in the church. Okay. Oh, no. Please. Okay. Yeah, don't laugh at me. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're okay. We're okay. Everybody, I don't know why we needed a lighter fluid. You just take some of those lit candles and walk upstairs and throw them down here, but it's fine. It's fine. We'll play by the rules. That's what we do. Oh, man, we're going to burn this whole place down. Yep, this whole place is just going up. We have committed a felony. Oh, how convenient. All right, what do we got up here? That door won't open. We got some weird paintings all over. What is the art? How will we even know what the artifact is? What is that? Well. Oh, we got the ladder for the well. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh my God. I've seen that asset a hundred times and for whatever reason when it's used well it works that's why everybody uses it because it still works all right let's go open up this chest real quick and then we can go in the basement and like the like the torches was it three seven nine four five was that it three seven four nine five okay we're good oh we got a shield so the shield will go on the night in the downstairs as well Whoa. Telling you, man, that was creepy. The crawling on the ground thing, that was creepy. I think everything we need is downstairs. All right, we got the shield. There's got to be something else, though. Yeah, we're still missing something. Um... Oh, we got the ladder in the well. We got to go to the well. That's what we need. The music. There's not a lot of music, but like the sound effects are creepy. They definitely add to the vibe. All right, let's go to the well. There can only be good things in the well, right? All right, let's go down and find out. Of course, there's a body in here. Hey. Just take that sword. What? Oh, of course she's down here. Don't. Don't kill me down here. Leave me alone. Oh, God. That's so creepy. It's so creepy. All right. Um, hello? It was me. It was me. It was me. It was me. That's fine. All right. So now we got to go back down. We have the sword to put the rest of that in. And then we'll see what that unlocks. Old church ba basements at that. Like, I just don't know why anybody would want to go down to these things. It's a terrifying time. But here we are. Here we are. Of course, there's a secret passage. All right. We go down further into the catacombs, which is going to only get worse. I mean, it's fine. I mean, what, what else could be down here, right? That we haven't already seen. All right, that door's locked. No worries there. A dungeon down here. Oh, this guy's fairly recent. We got a note here. These people here, they are monsters. First, they torture us, take our blood for some sort of ritual, and then when one is near their death, are taken someplace else and disposed of in a ceremony. These people speak of someone they call the master, but I have never seen him. 
Perhaps it is some sort of deity these cult, this cult worships. There was a priest here among us, and he caused pain to the followers of this cult. They disposed of him in the well, and only God knows what they did to him. I fear that I may be next. I cannot stand the thought of what will happen to me. Well, yeah, they, uh, we found a sword sticking in him, uh, in that well. Oh! Oh, that is so creepy. Okay. Gotta get out of here. Was that a minotaur? This door's open now. Are you serious? Oh, and here's our princess. Just blowing out candles left and right. The crusaders have come and torn our place apart. It won't be long before they discover my quarters here, but I will let them... But I'll not let them have the joy of taking me. I will make... The last offer to the master with my own soul, I will return stronger than ever. Oh boy. What is this? Chalice, okay. What do we do with the chalice? All right, well we do have the lighter. I don't know where that Minotaur guy went, but man, that guy was massive. All right, we do have the lighters to open, to light those torches again. Maybe the chalice goes underneath that thing? I don't know. It's possible, I guess. It's very possible. Because I think we've done just about everything else. So the lighter should light these. Maybe to open that door. There's one. There's two. It did does light it up. Let's see if it places something here. Yep. And it did unlock that door. Okay, good. All right. Down deeper we go. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? All right. Oh man. This is awful. This is so terrifying. Oh, you know, something's down here. We got something right here though. There's the coin. Oh, it looks like a lever here. I should open that door maybe behind us. Oh! Oh! What? Hello. Hello, all of you. Hi. Hi, none of you move, please. Don't know it and done it. Nobody move. I, I I appreciate it. Okay. Thank you. Alright, great. Okay, so we can't go back. Okay, you want me to go through this way? That makes sense. Alright. We can do that. Creepy statues. Another creepy statue. Oh, this is so wide open. I'm so terrified. There's like a trap door. Am I gonna, am I gonna, am I gonna pull this and I'm just gonna fall to my death? Let's, let's find out. Let's just try it. Oh, okay, it's an elevator. We're good. Oh no, we found their little ritual chamber. Are you guys all dead? Holy crap. You are terrifying. Okay. The artifact. Oh, this was what was requested. We got the artifact. Okay, I'm glad you knew what it was, because I sure as heck didn't. Alright, well let's just uh let's just leave. You guys how you're standing, I don't know. I don't wanna know. We're just leaving. We're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving. You guys can do your little stupid thing. Oh! I should have expected that. I should have expected that. Something worse. I should have expected that. Okay. I hate that we can't run right now. Let's just slowly leave. Boop, boop, boop. Got my artifact. I'm ready to go. Hopefully these things aren't blocking my way anymore. You know? Because, uh... Oh! 
shift to run. Oh, now we can run? Who is this guy? That's the guy that's been all caught up. Who's been watching us. Oh, we're gonna run right into her. Okay. Okay, she's help. Is she helping us? I don't even want to look back. We're not looking back. I look back. He's not even there. We're good. Huh. Oh. Oh. We're going on the other side. We're out of here. We're gone. Let's not mess around. Get in the car and get out of here. You got your 100K. Go. I left as quickly as I could. Thankfully, I was able to obtain the artifact that the man requested. As soon as I returned home, I reached out on the number provided by the mysterious man in order to exchange this book for my payment, but the number was no longer in service. It has now been a week and there's no trace of the man or this mysterious SMS group who contacted me. And worst of all, I believe that something followed me home from that cursed place. I am becoming paranoid. It feels as if someone or something is watching me. My only choice is to try to track down this company and get some answer as to why this book was so important. The only place left to try is the dark web. Surely something lies there that can explain who these people are. To be continued. Okay, so there is going to be a sequel. I did read that right. The developer is working on a sequel to this. I'm very interested to see how that sequel works out. Um, primarily because I did enjoy the game. I mean, it's a short one. It's definitely, you know, it can tell us the indie developer, but I like these. I like to see indie developers making these games for us to play. Um, so if you guys haven't tried it out, I definitely recommend it. I think it's a, for the price. I mean, I think it's a good time. It's a short game, but like, once again, the puzzles are not very difficult, but overall, um, I liked it. I, I do wish that some of the assets aren't being reused so much by indie game developers, but at the same time as indie game developers, I understand why they do that. So not a big deal, but let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below. Did you guys enjoy this game? Would you try it out yourself? If you did enjoy it, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate all of you guys watching. It does a lot for me and the video. So thank you so much. And remember guys, that life is a circus. Enjoy the freak show. And I will see you all next time.